best crime novel of the year. This is a big bauble. That's what you will be waiting for, isn't it, Gold Dagger? This is the Natus Ultra. This is the Mount Olympus, the big bauble. And it's the final dagger where you don't know the recipient. So it's ramping up the excitement. To run through the shortlist for us is that laudable cherry judges, Richard Reynolds. I always have a problem when David Headley and Richard Reynolds are in the same room. Because who do I call the best crime fiction bookseller in the country? Actually, for David Headley and Capital Crime, a round of applause, please. <laughs> I've known Richard for 35 years, longer, I think. In fact, we were, I was at Cambridge, and uh, we served uh, Wilkie Collins, Edgar Allan Poe, did we not? We had all the main writers at that time. At this time, I mentioned his much discussed list of 100 crime fiction novels. Quite a lot of the authors on the list are dead, but Richard remains one of the most enthusiastic promoters of living crime writers. Richard Reynolds. shortlist for the CWA Gold Dagger 2019. All the Hidden Truths, Claire Askew, Hodder and Stoughton. <laughs> the Puppet Show, M.W. Craven. <laughs> what We Did, Christabel Kent. <laughs> Unto Us a Child is Given. Donna Leon, Pine and Cornerstone. <laughs> American by Day, Derek B. Miller, Double Day Transport. <laughs> and The Station on the Road to Somewhere Better by Benjamin Wood. <laughs> and the winner is M. W. Craven. <laughs> shortlisted that year, and that was a publishing deal, which is phenomenal really. Also that year, I met Lee Child for the first time, and I shook his hand, and then my wife said, you have to stop shaking his hand, because this is just getting really, really, really awkward. <laughs> it was also the year that I said, let's drive to London, because it'll be cheaper than the train. <laughs> we'll give the person who said, we can leave our car at the garage, uh, a bottle of wine. I said, I'll get one from the kitchen. Three weeks later, my wife said, where's that uh, half bottle of wine uh, that we use for the spaghetti bolognese? <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, it, it's been great. But, um, enough of my ramble. I really wasn't expecting to win this. Um, I must say thank you to David Headley, who is, over there, what a marvellous bookseller and agent he is. Christina, my editor, who is just behind hugging him. I can, I can see actually, <laughs> or I hope it's hugging. Uh, my wife over there, who is sitting next to Beth, my publicist, and Hannah over there. Thank you very much, and thank you, everyone. I'm absolutely shocked with this. Thank you. <laughs>